this is a fight. We're going to see. This is a fight that will tell you if Jake Paul is the real deal or not. I think he is, but we'll see. We know one thing. Uh, Woodley is the real deal. That one thing, everybody can agree on that, right? Everybody can agree. Woodley is the real deal. That is the real deal. Not everybody's going to agree on Jake being the real deal. I think Jake is the real deal, but not everybody's going to agree with me. I think 50% or more are going to say he's not, and he's got so much hate on him that more people are going to want to tune in to watch him get his ass beat than people are going to want to see him win. He's, gonna, he's got so much hate. And you know what? He, he, um, I got to give him credit because the way he plays the heel – is the right way. He's not attacking country. He's not attacking family. He's not attacking girlfriends. He's doing stupid little things like Floyd Mayweather. I got your hat. I got your hat. Mm. Who the hell would ever thought that was going to trigger Floyd off and piss him off to no end? Yeah, he I was got pissed. your hat. I got your hat. <laughs> he was so he pissed. He didn't talk about his kid. He didn't talk about nothing. He got Now that is a genius right there. Come on. You can't disagree with that. It's kind of a slap in the face, though, a little bit. You know, like if someone slapped me in the face, it's going to be on. It, I mean, I can t tolerate, you know, I can talk. I can I can kind of be political with people, you know, especially if I know I can beat them up or whatever. But if someone, like, touches me or does something or, or you know, that, that's kind of a little bit uh, intrusive. And I don't know. I kind of that kind of that green light okay. kind of lights up a little bit. <laughs> would, would you rather that person grab your hat or talk about your mother, your country, your religion? I mean, honestly, grabbing a hat, I'd probably just laugh off, you know, because it's so immature. And, and I would just but, be like, dude, really? Like, did you just grab my hat? Like, I, I would laugh that and, off. And, probably. and it got him crazy. But, what about the other one? When he's in that truck, when he truck, when he's in that truck and, and, he, and he goes with the Bellator guy and he throws, he throws a, a toilet paper at him. He's throwing paper, toilet yeah, paper yeah, out. Yeah, he's yeah. calling him all Dylan kinds Dennis. of names. And he comes out running after him. And he's like, ha, ha, you pussy. Ha, ha, ha. And then he falls on his ass trying to hit him back with the toilet paper. I mean, what kind of stuff is that? That's like genius. Or what about when he went with DC? When he went, you know damn well he went purposely to that arena yeah. to, to entice him. But the problem is, DC don't, don't play. DC. That, 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 that was a... I'm telling you right that now. That could have been ugly. Straight up right now. You, you want to get your ass beat? Go with DC, then you can get your ass beat. That, 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 he ain't winning that one. I'm going to tell you this, Hob. From what I know from DC, and he's one of the funniest, craziest, goofiest guys ever to train with who I love to listen to uh, in the gym. But I'm going to tell you this. If DC didn't have a job with the UFC and he wasn't actually working where the, the, the UFC has a pretty strict policy on don't, don't fuck around and they'll cut you in a heartbeat if you screw up, if he wasn't working for the UFC and commentating and having everything that he has, Jay Paul would have got his ass beat. If, it, if, that, yep. if that had yep. happened at the hotel or something like that, Jay yep. Paul would have got at least slapped. They don't understand. They don't understand that. Leave, leave the bear alone. You've got to be careful who you poke. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, he's DC not, wouldn't he, take he that shit. He comes across as, as, as the real super funny kind of guy. Yeah. He'll fight, man. He ain't playing. No. He ain't playing. He will. You can't play with him like that. You no. cannot talk about him. You cannot do this. And, 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 you know, he'll fight you. And he'll fight you right then and there. And, yeah. If it was in a black, a, a dark alley or the street, forget the dark alley. If it wasn't in his during his job, I cannot tell you he wouldn't have. And it isn't going to be boxing. No. It ain't going to be boxing. You got to pick him up and slap <laughs> him. him on his what, head. Are gonna, what are you going to do? What yeah. are you going to do? Yeah. You better have the bodyguards protect you because there's nothing, nothing you could do that's going to stop this from smashing. He knocked out the heavyweight champ of the world. He could do anything. <laughs>